to be back although i did enjoy watching your show last week that was self-portrait self-portrait episode it was really good and i feel like it was kind of nice friends and i don't know how you feel i don't know what you're doing in your you know places where you're at now but what my favorite part of last week's episode was just drawing yeah. just drawing yeah. and and I mean, gluing is fun, and cutting is fun, and ripping papers fun, and all sorts of things are fun. But sometimes it's just nice to go where the crayons take you. So my friends, I was inspired today by last week, by the letter S this morning during the Sing Story Time, which featured the letter S, yeah. to, to draw today Scenes. Scenes. And obviously they agree because they're overwhelmed they with the excitement. Down. Just no, nah, <laughs> just one. Okay. Well, you know what? That too. You may have thought, Miss Rebecca, why are you all leaning in the art studio? And it's just because sometimes when it's so warm out and it's the end of summer. Don't you just want to take a little nap? I do. A little snoozer. So, that's all. And so that's how a sparrow a guy or gal was feeling, too. Just taking a little nap. Dude, when my brother and I were little, we would come to this library, and we would love to check out the Ed Emberly drawing books, especially oh. the Maker World, and we would just draw and draw and make scenes. It was really fun. And you may be asking, wait, Miss Rebecca, what are you talking about scenes? And I will tell you, scenes in this way, for our purposes, is really uh, whatever you want. So you're That's just cool. drawing whatever you want. So today I thought we would draw... Well, in the end, whatever we want, or whatever your super special grown-up tells you, or asks you to draw. Yeah. I am between drawing a shark, or my favorite spot of the summertime. So, it could be imaginary scenes? It could be an imaginary Because scene. I'm assuming you have never had super close contact with a shark. Well, the closest with a shark is when I was younger, my family and I went to Disney World, whichever one's in Florida. And in the water That's park, cool. my dad, Chester, and I went scuba diving, but not like real scuba diving, kind of real scuba diving. We had the snorkel on, and you'd go to this area, and you'd stay on the surface, you know, so your snorkel goes up. And there were sharks and fishes and things in this, like, aquarium you would snorkel across the surface of. So, I just don't understand. Is that safe? Well, I mean, it I had mean, to be safe. because you, of... you go in at your own risk. But, this is the thing. People think all sharks are just like, ah, give me a leg. Yeah. And that's not the situation. Some sharks at don't all. bite people at all. No, there's so many kinds of sharks. Yeah. And I think like such a small percentage of them have ever been shown to accidentally, you know, bite a person. They're I remember not, like out for people. They don't know right, who we are. Right, right. They live in the ocean. I don't live in the ocean. Do you? No. I don't. So they don't know what we are. Yeah. They don't have like a you know, like, they don't love us like we love Frosties. And you said the other day, when you were doing preschool story time, that sharks tell what things are and find out what things are with their mouths. What? Like, like babies. Oh, yeah, like babies. Yeah. Yeah. 
and baby sharks. Doo -doo. So my friends, what you will need today, simple, 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 starts with S. All these S words. There's a lot of S words. Paper. Any kind. Any kind, any kind your super special grown up said you can use. I just took some from the printer. So it's just printer paper. And then my handy dandy box of crayons. And you remember what happened last week, don't you? I saw that. I don't think while you're drawing, I'm going to focus on the drawing so it can be a surprise yes. at the end. Now what, now, what do you think? I mean, I feel like I'm torn. Should I draw a shark? Or, and it doesn't need to be a real shark. It could be just a shark that I draw for my brain. Or should I draw my favorite summer spot? Could you draw a shark in your favorite summer spot? If you felt like that would be pleasing. Can we try? Okay. Well, let's try. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Yeah. Okay. Well, so that's what we'll do. Hmm. So, well, here's this. Would you like me to sing a song about the shark? No. Oh, the shark babe has such teeth, dear. And it keeps them pearly white. Do you know that song? No. Oh, it's Does called Mac the Knife. It's a good song. And remember, it, here at the art studio, there's the table Scarlet is all bumpy, and so it gives our picture texture. That's what we found out last week that Van, Vincent Van Gogh actually used. This table. Did you say Vincent van Gogh? Yeah, Vincent van Gogh. He used this table, and that's why mo many of his pictures look textured. Is that a tree? It's a tree. What do you think? What do you think I'm drawing right now that's making this noise? What do you think? I think it. I know what it is because I saw, but it could be rain. But it's not. It could be leaves. It's leaves! And you know I have a problem with pressing hard. But I accept the consequences, the potential consequences of pressing hard with my my crayon. Because I'm just a hard presser. I am with pens and pencils too. I even have a little mark on my finger because I press it so hard. Really? Indentation. Dude, yeah. you do. When you were in school, did you guys ever have those things that went on your pencil to teach you how to hold them correctly? Yeah, I didn't like those. I never had one of those, but I knew some kids who had them. I don't hold my pencil correctly. I hold it the way it's correct for me. Are you this? Wait. Are you this holder? I don't know. I'm this holder. And then I squeeze it real tight. Uh, and then I have an indentation. And then that's my nail crazy. Too. Dude, that's crazy. It's true, though. I guess I don't use pens and pencils much anymore. Isn't like, that weird? I like to write with a pen and a pencil. I don't. See, I can't. Well, you're ahead of the time. No, I love to type. I mean, I love to type on a typewriter the first time I ever took typing. Like, it just, I love typing. So, okay. I don't know if that's ahead of the times or not. I just love typing. And to all of you who get to take school, choose different classes out there, I guess they call it keyboarding now. Well, I, they called it pause when I was there. What's that mean? Uh, it was how you learned how to put your fingers on the keyboard. Oh. I'm a very good typer. Oh, me, me too. Off. I just love it. Okay. Well, we're getting underway with our with our picture here. Hmm. I can't wait to see it. It makes me want to draw. Well, you all you can always draw. Yeah. I don't 
think I would draw a shark. Why? What would you draw, Miss Lynn? I think that I would go macro again and do some Ed Emberley's Make a World kind of thing. Mm. And draw like teeny tiny little things. Mm. I do like drawing with colored pencils. That was always my big thing is my brother and I would draw the Ed Emberley's Make a World with pencils. Colored pencils. I'm not gonna look. Do you have a favorite kind of shark? No. You just enjoy all of them. I just think they're fascinating. That they're just down there. Like, shut your eyes. Okay. Just shut your eyes. There are just sharks and octopuses and grizzly bears and lions and elephants and squids and little crabs and angelfish all out there right now. And we're right here. They're and they're out everywhere. There at the same time. And polar bears. They're everywhere. I'm still closing my eyes. Worms. Well, yeah, but we see worms. Peacocks. Did you know there are buffalo in South Park? I don't think I did. Oh my gosh. I had no idea until I saw them. I'm, go I'm done with my drawing. Like they're in an area. I'm going to put my crayons back. Okay. Before the big reveal. I can't even imagine why you... Cara likes colored like pencils that. too. I, I have colored pencils that I use in my coloring books at home. At the beginning of the pandemic, I would... I would Color my coloring books because it's nice. soothing. What kind of coloring book is it? Designs? It's a grown up, just like designs. the design kind. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's my broken ones. Well. Scarlet billows start to spread. I just felt compelled to color in the shark. I went a little bit out of the lines, but it happens. That's all right. Sometimes when you're a hard presser and you're just so feverish to fill it all in. <laughs> Did you? ever outline your stuff in black before you would color it in that was always my thing i love to outline things in black it just made it pop more it sounds like there's an inner drawer in you Ingrid. yeah well my it. friends look there's my oh my picture. gosh did you want to explain it at all sure this yeah, this my I favorite summer spot is my backyard on the patio. This is me sitting on the swing. Nice. I don't really know how to draw a swing. I don't know how you could, except but for that, because that's perfect. That's right. That's me on there. And I put nice. hair on myself, but you can't see because the swing is brown. And I had to stay true to the brown swing. Right, so my right. Is brown. It's camouflage. Yeah. There's my book. And there's nice. the table next to the swing. Nice. And this is a tree. Nice. This is a crazy hair clear tree. Nice. It does not look this green right now because it hasn't been very rainy. Oh, you know, it hasn't. And there's a shark. Shark? That's a great shark. Does it have a name or you don't know it yet? No. I really like that picture. So that's my drawing. That's uh, It's a scene. That's my scene. That's, That's my art. Awesome. This is my art. Yep. And I wonder what your art looks like, too. I think it's cool. Thanks. Thank you, Michelle. Well, my Becca. friends, this is the last episode of the summer season. We will see you in September for some more self-expression through art. Do you know that song? I'll see yeah. you in, in September. September. Isn't that a great song? Oh, I just weird. remember it from my dad listening to 
Yeah. Have a good time, but remember there is day. Okay. Do 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 do.